Good morning, children. Welcome back to the evening's class. Morning. Yeah. Very good morning. In last class, we have learned the lesson number four, being safe. Right? Lesson number four, being safe. Yes, only half lesson we have done and next part, the next topic I will be teaching today, okay? Shall we start? Shall we start children? Yes. See, before continuing the next part, once again I will teach whatever we have learned in the last class, okay? Yes. Yeah. Children, please mute your phone, off your camera, please. Yes, very good, very good. See, first, the lesson name is being safe. Lesson number four, being safe. Now tell me, what is uh, the meaning of safe? Being safe is called? Being safe is called? To stay away from the danger or injury. Right? Yes, we can stay safe if we are careful. Safety means staying away from danger or injury. And also in last class, I had explained about the safety rules which you have to follow at home. In school and on the road. Right? So once again, uh, I will repeat all those safety rules for you all. Okay? The safety rules which we have to follow at home is we must stay away from fire. Right? We must stay away from the fire. That means... We should not enter the kitchen. We should not means you should not enter the kitchen. Why? Because still you are small. Right? You all are too young to do the kitchen work. That's why stay away from the fire. Don't enter the kitchen when nobody is there. No, uh, your parents or any elders is not there in the kitchen. Please don't enter the kitchen. And don't on the gas. Don't switch on the gas. Don't use any matchsticks or candles to play. Understood? We must stay away from fire, burning candles and etc. We must not try to light matchsticks. You all like to uh, light the matchstick, I know. It is very... Uh, what we say, you all like to do that. It is funny, right? But it is very dangerous, children. So, don't try to light matchsticks. We must not go near the gas, uh, gas stove while it is in use. When gases are in use, you should not go near the gas stove. We must stay away from touching hot utensils. That's why I said don't enter the uh, enter the kitchen. Okay. When you want something, ask your elder to give. Understood? Don't touch any hot utensils. Don't go near the gas stove when it is in use. Don't try to light the mastics. Don't play with the candles. Okay. These are the safety rules. These are the safety rules you have to follow to be safe at home. Understood? And now the rainy season is going on. So don't go near the well or uh, near the water tank. Is that clear? Yes. And we must not play with sharp or pointed things. One more thing that you all have to remember is we must not play with the sharp objects or sharp things like knives, anything. Scissors. 
Okay, don't play with that sharp objects. Why? Because we may get cut. आपको अच्छा लगता है जब आपको ऐसे कट हो कि यहाँ से ब्लड निकलता है तो हाउ यू फील यू फील गुड you have to dry your hands first make sure that your hands are not wet better you don't touch those electric switches okay ask a elder to do that work for you understood we can get a shock if we do so we can get shock if we if you touch any electric switches with wet hand you may get shock so be careful and next is we should not open the door for strangers why why we should not uh, open the door for strangers wo chor bhi ho sakte hain koi aur bhi ho sakta hai right it is very danger to open the door for the stranger so If you uh, if you don't know that who's that person who's standing on your door, so better you call your parents or elders. Those are there in your house. Let them open the door or let them come and talk to them. You don't open the door for any strangers. Stranger का मतलब क्या है बच्चों? जो आप नहीं पहचानते हो, जो हम नहीं पहचानते हैं सामने वालों को तो वो हमारे लिए stranger होता है. Okay? We must inform an elder at home in case of any injury. See, if you get any kind of injury or anything, you should not hide that from your parent. You should go and tell. Okay, what happened? How it happened? You should go and tell to them if in case of any injury. Understood? Don't hide anything from your parents. And the next is safety in school. What are the safety rules you have to follow in school to be safe? The first one is we should not run on the stairs. Why? Why we should not run on the stairs in school? What happens if we run? Tell me what happens if we run on the stairs in school? Fall. Yes, we may fall and we may get. Hard. That's why we should not run on the stairs. We should not push each other. Why? Why we should not push each other? If we push someone, he or she may get hurt because of us. Because of us, किसी को बुरा लगा, बुरा हो गया तो आपको अच्छा लगता है. हमारे वजह से किसी को चोट चोट आ गया तो आपको अच्छा लगता है. No, no, so we should not push anyone. We should not push each other in the corridor or in the classroom. Corridor में भी push नहीं करना है, class में भी push नहीं करना है, कहीं भी push नहीं करना है. What happens if you push someone in the class? He may get hurt because benches रहते हैं class में. Benches के edge उधर यहाँ और यहाँ लग गया तो उसको चोट हो सकता है इसलिए कॉर्डर में रहने दो या क्लास में रहने दो वी शुड नॉट पुश एनी वन अंडरस्टूड वी मस्ट नॉट इंसर्ट पेंसिल और एनी ऑब्जेक्ट इनटू आवर माउथ आईज एंड नोज एंड इयर्स ओके वी शुड नॉट पुट एनीथिंग इन आवर आईज नोज इयर्स एंड माउथ बी केयरफुल पेंसिल्स एंड ऑल द शॉर्ट एज जो रहता है अब भी आप कान में या नाक में या आईज में घुसा दे तो क्या होता है यू मे गेट द सीवियर इंजरी राइट परमानेंट इंजरी हो सकती है सो टू अवॉइड दैट डू नॉट इंसर्ट एनीथिंग इन योर इयर्स माउथ आईज एंड नोज ओके 
Yes, we should walk or stand in a queue. Whenever you are in school, you have to follow this rule. Otherwise, your P teacher will punish you, right? Yes or no? Your P teacher, they always tell that be in a queue, walk in a queue, come in a queue, go in a queue, right? So, we always follow this queue system in school to avoid any Injury. What happens when you all rush at a time? You may fall and you may get hurt. That's why we always move in a queue. We should wait for our turn on the slide or the swing. When you go out, when you go out in the ground to play, we always should wait for our turn on swing or slide. When you swing, jula jhulte rehta hai to uske aage ya पीछे हमें जाके खड़े नहीं होना चाहिए शुड नॉट स्टैंड इन फ्रंट और बिहाइंड जब वो झूला झूलते रहते हैं तो वो आके आपको चोट लग सकता है राइट दीज आर द सेफ्टी रूल्स विच यू हैव टू फॉलो इन द स्कूल टू बी सेफ अंडरस्टोर्ड All of you understood, children? Will you follow this? Will you all follow these rules? Yes, very good. And next is next is safety on the road, which is very very important to be safe. Understood? See here, safety on the road. What all the safety? Uh, rules we have to follow on the road. That is, we must cross the road with elders. Now you are too small to cross the road by your own. Yes or no? So take a help of an elder to cross the road. You alone don't go to cross the road. It is very dangerous. Understood? So we must cross the road only with elders. Okay, you will follow this. Yes, yes, we must cross the road only with elders. We must walk on the footpath, not on the road. Where we have to walk on the footpath. We should use that space to walk. We should not walk on the road. Road is meant for only. For vehicles, हम चलने के लिए फुटपाथ रहता है तो फुटपाथ में ही चलना है okay? We must cross the road at the zebra crossing. Have you seen zebra crossing on the road? Have you seen zebra crossing on the road? Yes, ma'am. हाँ वो क्यों होता है zebra cross? Why they made zebra cross? For what purpose? Yes. See what it is. Can you see this picture? Yes. What it is? What it is? Road. Road. And this black and white bars are. Zebra crossing. This is zebra crossing where we have to cross the road. Zebra crossing पे ही हमें road cross करना है. Understood? When there is a zebra cross, the vehicle reduces their speed. Vehicles में जो आते हैं, वो zebra crossing के पास अपने speed को वो कम करते हैं. They reduce their speed. क्यों क्योंकि जीब्रा क्रॉसिंग में लोग रोड क्रॉस करते रहते हैं इसलिए सेफ है कि हम जीब्रा क्रॉस पे भी रोड क्रॉस करें ओके वी मस्ट क्रॉस द रोड एट द जीब्रा क्रॉसिंग वी मस्ट नॉट रन ऑन द रोड ओके व्हेन यू क्रॉस द रोड वी शुड वॉक एंड क्रॉस द रोड वी शुड नॉट रन ऑन द रोड अंडरस्टूड फर्स्ट वी शुड सी दिस साइड and left and right 
Then walk and cross the road. Don't run on the road. And try always cross the road on zebra crossing. And the next topic in this lesson is tell me what it is. Yes, what it is? Signal, traffic lights. Have you seen this in Bangkok City? Tell me in Bel Tell me in Belgami. Uh, where you, where we can see this kind of traffic lights? Name few place. Bogar. Very good. Bogar base. Nice. Yes. I have seen in RPD. I have seen in RPD. Next is railway over bridge. Yes. Near railway over bridge, one signal is there, and one is in Bogar base, and one is in the main signal. Who will tell first, first, first? One road goes to CBD and one day one road goes to Ramdev. Who will tell? One circle is there. Which circle? Which circle? You can see one statue there. You can see one statue there. No, Kolapu circle, no. Kolapu circle is there. Before Kolapu circle, one more signal is there. Yes? Chandamma circle. It is Chandamma circle. What is that? Chandamma circle. So now tell me the color of the signal light. Red. 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 Yellow. Green. Now anyone can tell that what is the meaning of this red, sim uh, red signal? Red signal means what children? आप जब रोड पे जाते रहते हो तो सिग्नल पे रेड लाइट पड़ता है तो आपके पेरेंट्स क्या करते हैं दे स्टॉप देयर व्हीकल राइट दे स्टॉप देयर व्हीकल व्हेन दे सी दिस रेड सिग्नल प्लीज म्यूट योर फोन अथवा अथवा मानिक प्लीज म्यूट यस सी व्हेन देयर इज a red light in signal what your parents do they stop their vehicle so red means what what this is this means what stop red means red means stop red means stop and now yellow means what Yellow means what? In signal, yellow color indicates yes, yes. See, in signal, yellow color indicates slow down. Yellow color indicates slow down. Slow your vehicle. And green color in signal, green color indicates. Yes. Go. Go. Yes. So whenever you come out or whenever you cross the signal, observe the signal lights. Okay. It also shows the minute and seconds, right? Two minute ka signal hai. Two minute ka signal hai to. Then the time you can see the time over there. So whenever you come.
come out with your parents please observe the signal lights with the timing understood okay see traffic lights are present at the road crossing we can see this traffic lights at the road crossing they help to control the traffic what is the use of the traffic light what is the use of this traffic lights ye kyu hote hai roads pe traffic lights it helps to control the traffic see yes it helps to control the traffic see abhi aise road hai aise road hai okay yahan bhi road hai yahan bhi road hai yahan bhi hai here also road is there see some vehicles are coming from this side some vehicles are coming from this side some are from this side some are from this side if there is no traffic light in this crossing what happens sabhi vehicles yahan aake jama ho jate hain right yes or no yes yahan traffic jam ho jata hai to koi bhi kahan bhi nahi ja sakta hai no one can go anywhere because of this traffic jam so this traffic lights see this traffic lights help the traffic to move or to stop it shows see abhi yahan se vehicle aa raha hai to yahan se ye jo red light dikh raha hai na aapko agar ye yahan red light dikhai to ye jo vehicle ye jo road hai ye yahan ke jo log hai wo apne vehicle yahan stop karte hain so this people can go here and this people can go here aur yahan yahan jaane wale bhi ja sakte hain aur yahan se yahan aane wale bhi aa sakte hain yes or no now after 2 minutes they will reach to ye jo log hai ye apne raste ye bhi without any traffic jam they also move easily so this traffic light helps to control the traffic okay is it useful yes it is very very useful because of this traffic light we also can cross the road easily right heavy traffic sabhi jagah se vehicles aa rahe ko will not be able to cross the road because of because of this traffic light we also can cross the road easily so here red light indicates red light indicates stop yellow light indicates slow down and green light shows uh it gives the signal to go understood try to make one traffic light symbol like this it is very easy to make i have taken one straw and one black piece of paper on that i have stick three color paper red yellow and green try to do this as a activity is very easy to do we must cross the road only when the walk signal is green one more thing that you all have to follow that in your page number 18 you can see we should cross the road only when this walk symbol green is on this red means we should not cross the road we should stop when this one is on then we should cross the road okay you all can see this yes and see here uh, this traffic light which i explain now the first traffic light were used in london in the year of 1868 london mein traffic light kab use kiye hai pata hai aapko london mein traffic lights they have used in the year of 1868 dekho tab se use kar rahe ho traffic light london mein 
1868 से वो लोग ट्रैफिक लाइट्स यूज कर रहे हैं ओके रिमेम्बर दिस सो डू हैव एनी डाउट इन दर रिगार्डिंग दिस लेसन नो डाउट यू अंडरस्टूड एवरीथिंग Yes. So you all will follow the safety rules which I said at the home, in the school, on the road. You all will follow those rules to be safe. Yes. Yes. Please follow those rules because now you all are staying at home. Don't trouble your parents. Follow the safety rules and stay away from the danger and injury. Okay. Don't enter the kitchen and don't use any matchsticks, candles to play. Don't play with any sharp objects like scissors, knives, and anything. They can't keep watching you all the time. It is your responsibility to be safe. Okay? Yes. Yes. If you have any doubt, you can ask me. Do you have any doubts, Indra? No. No. So you all have got this new uh, textbook, right? EBS textbook, sab ko mila hai. Yes, Indra. Why? So those who have textbook, read the textbook, read the lesson. Lesson reading is very very important. Spellings write in and practice. Don't by heart. Spellings जो है आपको लिख लिख के practice करना है. Okay, जब आपको spelling आएगा तभी आप sentence में answer लिख सकते हैं. Okay, so practice all the spellings. Write and practice. Read the lesson. In next class, we will do the textual work. Okay, now time is there. Shall we do now only? Shall we do now? Open page number. Open page number nineteen. Open page number nineteen, children. Open page number nineteen. Choose the correct answer. We should cross the road. Okay. We should cross the road at the zebra crossing anyway on the footpath. We should cross the road. हमें road cross कहाँ करना है? At the zebra crossing. Anyway, you are on the footpath. Where we have to cross? Yes. At the zebra crossing. Very good. Very good. First one A. At the. At the zebra crossing. At the zebra crossing, so please tick on uh, option A at the zebra crossing. You have to tick it now. Option A, tick option A at the zebra crossing. Done. Ho gaya. Done, children. Second one, second one. The green signal in the traffic light says. The green signal in the traffic light says, "Go, slow down, stop, rest." Yes. 
ग्रीन सिग्नल इन द ट्रैफिक लाइट ग्रीन सिग्नल क्या होता है स्टॉप या गो गो समन सेड स्टॉप स्टॉप इज अ रॉन्ग आंसर सी ए स्टॉप इज अ रॉन्ग आंसर ग्रीन सिग्नल शोस गो ओके ग्रीन सिग्नल सेस गो सो ऑप्शन ए सेकंड वन ऑप्शन ए गो प्लीज टिक ऑन ऑप्शन ए सेकंड वन आल्सो ऑप्शन ए गो सेफ्टी मींस स्टे अवे फ्रॉम इंजरी हैप्पीनेस हेल्थ केयरफुलनेस सेफ्टी मींस staying away from injury very good safety means staying away from injury kya hai injury injury ka matlab kya hai what is the meaning of injury chot lagna okay understood yes third one third one option a injury so please tick on option a injury third one understood next one page number 20 open page number 20 This one is done. See, the next is instead of uh, sorry, read the clues then fill in the missing letters to complete the word. Instead of using knife to sharpen my pencil, I should use a. What I should use to sharp my pencil instead of knife? Tell me. What I should use to sharp my pencil instead of knife? What you all use to sharp your pencil? Very good, pencil sharpener. See now, you all can see the boxes, right? P is there. P is there. Yes or no? P. Pencil spelling. Pencil spelling. A ha A P E N Right P E N C I L pencil and next says sharpener see I don't have place there that's why I'm writing here sharpness pane yes at a r p e y l e r pencil sharpener so instead of using knife to sharpen your pencil what do you have to use pencil sharpener right Write all the spellings correctly. Don't miss spelling. Second one. Instead of playing with match sticks, I should play with. Instead of playing with match sticks, I should play with fire. You should play with what? Tell me. Hmm. Toys. Very good. 
instead of playing with match sticks you should play with toys spelling of toys t o y s okay done yes in next class i will do this match the following okay only match the following it is remain so we'll see if i can we can do here yeah. match the following first one is zebra crossing what is that zebra crossing so where you will match zebra crossing a b c d e zebra crossing to cross the road where it is to cross the road yellow light sharp object see this try to do read and try to do by yourself otherwise in, uh, tomorrow i have one more class so in tomorrow's class we will do this okay try to read and try to match on your own we'll see you can do or not if not in tomorrow's class i will do this for you okay